Hello from IEC 2025. Here we have the UCX100 um, IP flexible studio camera that is built to meet the demands of live events and beyond. Here I'm with Justus. Hello. To detail it a bit more. So Justus, why does this camera stand out on the market? The camera stands out on the market because we have actually looked how the people are using um, studio cameras and the UC4000 in general. And we have found that it needed to have a new, complete new design. So the camera design is, uh, is, has been developed from the ground up over the UC4000. It has a new 5.8K sensor, which is newly developed for this kind of camera. Um, it's using the same um, sensor design, so it uses a single MOS sensor with an expansion lens in front of it, which, which gives us the chance um, to project the incoming image to a onto a larger sensor area, which means that each, each individual photo sites can be made bigger and we can put more in it. So the sensor in this camera is actually a 5.8K sensor with improved dynamic range, which makes it a good camera in the first place. But the second case, of course, is um, the use of MOIP or AV over IP features in this camera. It supports SC2110, uncompressed and compressed, uh, up to UHD resolution and uh, over the one gig network port it supports a variety of streaming features like SRT and high bandwidth NDI. So it's a very compelling package that combines great camera technology and great IT technology as well. Can you please elaborate a bit more about the adoption of IP protocols and standards? Yes, of course. Um, the camera can be used with a 702110 straight from the camera. It features two redundant uh, 25 gig SFP ports where you can change out the transceiver modules depending on the infrastructure that you're working in. You can use it to um, to produce um, 702110 uncompressed and compressed with JPEG-XS up to UHD resolution and in parallel you can even output streaming formats such as SRT, RTP or uh, high bandwidth NDI. That's pretty cool. And uh, speaking about uh, CCU-less operation, yeah. why is it beneficial in the uh, live events market? CCU-less operation is a new trend that has emerged because the camera is actually powerful enough to produce um, the ready-made image from the camera. So there's, um, there's less demand to have a CCU for single-speed output. So, um, with CCU-less workflow, you're using the um, camera in SD2110 mode and directly attaching the camera to the media network that you're working in and thus reducing the setup time um, because yeah, you lose another piece of equipment that you don't have to care about and the camera feeds directly into your network. That's why it makes uh, production more efficient. And um LED uh, applications are nowadays uh, more and more uh, popular and common. Um, can uh, the UCX100 be used in such kind of uh, productions? We have actually looked at the different applications that the customers are using the UC4000s in. And um, we have, so actually we have tuned the color filter array of the sensor to fit the red, green and blue LEDs on the LED wall so that none of the colors are attenuated and that uh, color repro reproduction in front of an LED screen remains faithful. Plus, um, the UCX100 features an option for the low-pass filter, which can be built into a, a filter wheel. And uh, if you use the uh, low-pass filter, it reduces basically the more ray artifacts that you have when you shoot uh, in front of an LED screen with a single more sensor camera. Well, there are already existing uh, fleets of uh, studio cameras and uh, PTZ cameras at customer side. Um, can uh, the UCX100 be integrated in the and used, for example, next to UE160 PTZ camera? Um, yeah, actually, because we see more and more that studio camera and PTZ camera become equal partners on a live production somewhere. So um, it just seemed necessary at this point in time to construct the PTZ camera and the studio camera to put it on the same foundation, meaning that both cameras use the same image sensor and the same 
um, uh, image processing inside of the camera. So both cameras will match straight out of the box without adjustments of matrices, etc. That's cool. Thank you very much for your time Thank you and the much. overview. The camera is already available on the market. So if you want to know more, please reach out to us at Panasonic. We hope you like it and we'll see you soon.